I'm back. So uh, in this video, I will do the mega review for serum. The previous video actually sunscreen edition. So if you haven't checked that out, uh, check that video out. So now I will review the serum. Let me count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So actually eleven, eleven uh, serum. So let me try with the active ingredient. So this year and last year i don't think i try many active ingredients i just try to go gen gentle with my skin so the first one that i try actually the tm this is very good very good uh, niacinamide serum it's niacinamide uh, 10 percent plus zinc two percent oh no sorry 10 percent niacinamide and two percent arbutin which is very light very light sunscreen and it's also help with your dark spot so if you have a dark spot it really help with your hyperpigmentation uh, and also I don't think this one is harsh even though it's 10% but it's pretty gentle and this finish is just like give you glowy finish like healthy look so it's good yeah I like this one definitely like my favorite and the next one is also from TM this one also underrated this one is niacinamide but 20% so it's mean double than the yellow one but this one it's focus uh, on for pores and oily skin so this one let me check uh, yeah niacinamide 20% and zinc 1% so meanwhile this one focus for hyperpigmentation and also kind of controls the oil for niacinamide this one also controls uh, oil production and also focus on pores so actually uh, this is the first serum that I try and um, I took a picture of my skin before and after I have it you can check on my Instagram it really worked for the pores so I was impressed really so surprised so I just keep promoting this one to my friends or customer this one is really good but this one of course sounds scary is 20% so if you have sensitive skin just don't go to this one you might can you can try the 5% niacinamide and then slowly go to 10% and then after that you go to this one 20% uh, when I use this one I feel like tingling sensation a little bit yeah but this is great so both of this they are very light watery in texture and it's just absorbed very fast so you can you can use it very easy for this one the next one it will be Cosarec this one is Cosarec uh, vitamin C 23% so uh, actually the Cosarec has two vitamin C one is 13% and this one is 23% I try this one uh, for my hyperpigmentation and I think it works uh, pretty well too but this one I think is pretty strong so yeah I can feel like tingling sensation and also a little bit uh, hot kind of so I will recommend <clears throat> when you use this one just use a little bit and also mix it with a lot of soothing and hydrating ingredient and also this one is kind of like easy to um, how do you say that um oxidize this one is the dropper so yeah it's easy to oxidize so now it's actually totally orange in color but first the color is a kind of yellowish so yeah that's fine so if you don't have sensitive skin and you're looking something like a medicine i mean it's not medicine but really focus on your hyperpigmentation you try this one oh one more and this one i really feel it boosts my <laughs> collagen in a way i can feel my skin getting like very plump from inside so I really think it works for collagen booster that's good so what else so that's my three active and the next one let's go to soothing uh, serum 
So actually I have four. Tadam. So the first one, let's discuss this one. Uh, I don't see, I don't think a lot of people see this one. It's not very popular and I don't think they have it now. They might be discontinued. This one is Sir Medic, also from Neogen. Super Ceramide 100. Uh, this one is very interesting texture. It's like, oh yeah, I ran out everything, but actually it's so pretty. It's like, they have kind of like a bubble, like green and yellow. It's so cute. And it's just so interesting texture, but when you blend it, it's just blend effortless, effortless, effort, you know what I mean. <laughs> yeah, effortlessly. Yeah, that's the word. So this one I remember has a very nice scent. In general, I love Neogen product, so it's this one is very nice. It's very hydrating, moisturizing as well. Next one, the ample and the ample and this one is the ceramide shot. Actually, in terms of texture, is like white milky texture. I don't have the bottle with me, but this one is very moisturizing because most of the serum that I have is kind of like more hydrating in a way but this one is like very moisturizing so it kind of sit on top of your skin for a while so not really absorb fast so some people especially the oily skin might not like this one but I really think this one is very help with you know soothing and repair your skin so if you don't like that kind of feel just use this one at night you know but I really think this one is a very good so if you use any active like vitamin C or retinol I think this one is a good serum to combine for this one is ceramide and the next one is XCY Artichoke Intensive Skin Barrier Ampoule. This one also very good. Uh, it's very hydrating, very refreshing. It's just very light and soothing. So this one also great. Another one. Actually, this is the new one. It isn't three? Onion New Pair B5 Ampoule. So it contains B5, which is uh, pentanol and also onion extract. So this one is very light, also very hydrating. So it's just uh, soothing and also calming. So I feel like it's kind of similar in terms of the feel. But this one is like thicker. This one is like lighter. But both like absorb well and it just blends nicely and soothing and calming. I think it's kind of similar both are great if you want to pair this pair it with also active ingredient so it's kind of you know balance out the, the the skincare routine and the next one what do I have mm, I have another one from ample and as well but this one is the peptide shot I don't have it with me now but actually this one has very similar not similar interesting texture because it's like gold and you can see the gold thread peptide thread is like a little worm which is so interesting but it feels luxurious it's a bit sticky in a way but it, I don't mind but this one it really gives you very healthy glow and plum uh, I remember when I tried this one, my friend is like, oh wow, your skin looks great. So this one is very good. It's focused on uh, plumping your skin, like anti-wrinkle. This one contains peptide. So you should try this one. Uh, next one, Beauty of Joseon. Actually, this is the only Beauty of Joseon serum that I try. Uh, the Revive Serum or Repair Serum, Ginseng and Snail Mucin, which is brown in color. Yeah, but of course I finished everything. It's so cute. The bottle is so small. And this one uh, is good. 
I mean, it's like high rating. I don't have much thing to say about this. In general, I think Beauty of Jason product, they are very decent. So yeah, this one is good. Next one. This one is Nasafik AHA, uh, AHA BHA Serum. Uh, actually, this is one of my first five serum. I remember when I used this one together with this one, right? It's just so good. Like my friend really say like, oh, your skin, it looks great. But, you know, it can be not, maybe not because of the serum. It's also because when the first time you tried the skincare, right? I think your skin kind of improved a lot from the previous, um, you know, previous time. So I think people notice right away. And this one is really give me like a nice glow, very nice. But this one, even though the name is AHA BHA, but actually their AHA BHA is so little. Let me find. See, only 100 ppm, which is, I think is 0, 0.000 something, 001. So this one, even though it's exfoliate, but it's gentle exfoliate. So you can, you can use this one every day. It's fine. This one is great. And this one is, has a watermelon extract, which is good. And last one. This one is uh, number Zin, number three, skin softening. This one is so popular. And I can see why. Let me see if I still have it. I remember I like the scent. It's just kind of very subtle, so very nice. This one has uh, fermented ingredient. Let me check. Uh, yeah, the galactomyces and bifida. So they claim it will uh, help with your texture and pores and, you know, just hydrate the skin in general, make it skin healthier. So uh, I think this one is very decent, absorb very fast. Um... It makes skin feel healthy. I don't see much about the texture wise because I think for that kind of result you need to use it like you know more than one bottle. So if you finish one bottle I don't think that's enough to see the the long term effect. Because the thing is I'm selling skincare so even though I love this one I want to use it again but I can't. I kinda need to try any other product, you know so i can give uh, my customer a review and stuff so yeah i like this one good so let's see mm, it's a, a bit different with sunscreen video because in sunscreen video i have like two products that you know two out of ten or three out of ten but here in the serum i don't see any really like this one 11 out of 10 this one also 11 out of 10 very good like uh, this one is 10 out of 10 mm. this one also very good like 9 out of 10 it's because expensive so you know instead of 10 is 9 <laughs> uh, what else the ampullin both are great and also actually quite affordable so this one also, I think, 10 out of 10, 10 out of 10, easy. Uh, the beauty of Jason, it's alright, so I can say 8, you know, 8 out of 10. Uh, this one, the Axis Y, mm, I like the soothing, calming product, so I can say 9 out of 10. This one also 9 out of 10. This one, mm, this is kind of my first first love in a way. I love it, 10 out of 10. And the last one, this one. This one is a bit difficult to say because it's effect effective, like 10 out of 10 for the effectiveness, but the smell is not too nice and you kind of need to be careful when you use it. Not too much, or if it's too much, it might be burn your skin, you know. And also, you need to put it in the fridge. And also, the 
you know after you open it you only can use it within three months if i'm not wrong or six months it's just like a short period so i, I kind of need okay i need to use it as fast as i can but at the same time like i cannot because if i put too much and then my skin you know it's not gonna react well so this one is a bit tricky but it's effective so use this one if you know if you just want to focus on loose collagen and hyper hyper pigmentation but if you want like healthy glow or something like that uh, don't use this one just choose another serum I think um, that's all for me for the mega review for the serum so thank you very much for listening bye bye